Here it is. Eligard's Redstone Laboratory. Seems more like an entrance or a foyer or something. Don't worry, pal. We'll find her. I just hope she can actually help us. Hey guys, Blocks1000 here, and welcome back to some more Minecraft story mode. In the last episode, we arrived in Redstonia in search of Eligard, the Redstone Engineer. And in this episode, we are going to find Eligard, the Redstone Engineer, hopefully. <laughs> Here we are, Eligard's laboratory. Pretty cool looking. I wish I was that good at Redstone. Is that even. I don't even think that's possible in Minecraft to get, like, blocks to move by themselves. Um, maybe it is. Or maybe I just don't know about it. Like I said, I'm not the best at Minecraft. Be the most redstone stuff I've ever seen in my life. You can say that again. Come on, let's keep moving. Olivia, you are literally the biggest redstone nerd. How can, how can you even see less Maybe. redstone than this? I don't know. Breaking things up. Keeping intruders out. There are lots of possibilities. Okay. They left an exposed torpedo out. How lucky of us. Um Okay, almost. Definitely a step in the right direction. Yeah, so we're basically slowing down the repeater. If you know your Minecraft stuff, this basically makes the repeater last longer, so we'll have more of a chance to get through. Pretty nice. Press up. Aha! Nicely done, Jesse. You're pretty good at this. Hey, Thank you. What can I say me and the redstone just speak to each other? That's creepy. Uh -huh. She's moving a lot of different ingredients around here. Man. Uh, I have no idea what I'm looking at. I actually literally have no idea what I'm looking at. I agree with Jesse. Now, I don't want to alarm you, Olivia, but I have no idea what I'm looking at here. I love the way that he says that. That's why I'm studying. Come on, let's keep moving. Okay. So, this right here is a fountain of lava. Uh, or lava curtain, as it's called. Uh, let's flip the lever. We don't have to look at it. Pull the lever. Jesse, move faster. I don't have all day to let you walk across the room. That's awesome. I wish that lava fell that quickly in actual Minecraft. That'd be a lot more helpful, because my lava, fall lava falls so slowly in that game, in Minecraft. Um, okay, uh, this is Zipper. I have no idea how these are actually built in Minecraft. Thankfully, this game does a good job of explaining it. Let's flip the lever here. Uh, please, flip it. There we go. There we go, it's open. The zipper. I like that. Hey. That was basically just a giant zipper, but it's like a redstone mechanic. It's kind of cool. Uh, there we go. We're getting sucked up into it. I love, I love how they used that, like, that's like a thing that's actually in Minecraft, like the whole water elevator thing. And guess what? There she is. This is just like I dreamt it. Entering Eligard's laboratory, seeing her right there. She'll ask me to be her apprentice, and the next thing you know, we'll be changing the world together. Let's just try to save the world first. Time to pace back and forth and check the system. All assistance. right, let's talk Time to, to her. Operation. And see if she'll help us on our Little journey. Latency, speedy. Whoa, hi. Hey, didn't see you sneaking up on me. That's <laughs> got the point. Don't touch anything in here, okay? It's all supremely fragile and genius. She's Did very full of herself. We're starting to have second thoughts here. New assistants, what they she thinks that we're her assistants. Pig, that is. <laughs> uh, we're she, not assistants. She thinks we're her new assistants. Eligard. No time for specifics, I'm afraid. Hey, you. Very right to the, the point. Girl. Switch on that T-flop circuit to activate the delivery chutes. And you, non-goggle guy? Grab non a guy. And an iron block. She oh. wants me to do something for her. What if I screw it up? What if I... Oh, I feel lightheaded. Okay, so Olivia's gonna go ahead and faint. Wow. Now I need an assistant to help with my assistant. Think you can handle it on your own? Alright, so uh, we don't want to screw things up, so let's go and do that. We'll check out Olivia after, see how she's doing. In the meantime, uh, hold on, let's press this button. Button pushing hey, mastery. Is on. Ruby's Ruben, Ruben's just like Olivia. Rod, Olivia, are you okay? Rock. 
Alright, we need the iron block and the blaze rod. So, iron block. And... Blaze rod! There we go! Woo! Reuse source material. They just share the same animation twice. Uh, okay, let's go get those things. Uh, yeah, if you actually talk to Olivia, then Eligard gets mad at you and does it herself. So we don't want to disappoint her as our, as our first job as assistants. Let's just grab this. Why did Jesse walk away, away wow. from the chest to grab Blaze that? Rod. It's all tingly. Tingly. Tingly base rod. Just what the engineer ordered. Uh, Eligard, Sounds like some kind of reference or something. You asked for? Ah, excellent. Fantastic. Love it. Always All right. happy to have a capable set of hands around. Carrying materials, disposing of fainted assistants, you know, that sort of thing. <laughs> Jesse's just like, what's up? <laughs> and she's still trying to make a command block. And it didn't work. Loser. Ugh. Trial number 6,451. Another bust. She did that many trials within now, that I'll short amount of time? Here. Excuse me? Excuse me. Could you please not lie on my floor anymore? Someone's gonna trip over you while carrying lava, and it's gonna be such a mess. Lava everywhere. And boy, nothing gets lava out. Nothing. It, it, more lava. <laughs> I don't think that I've ever fainted before. That card's awesome. I was just so excited to meet you, and and with me always pacing around. Uh, don't blame Olivia. Thoughts. Don't blame Olivia. You may be a member of the Order of the Stone, but you are a jerk sometimes. That. Well, that seems a little unfair to blame Olivia. It's not her fault that she was so excited. She's a lot. She's pretty awesome, well, but she's also a jerk. Assistant position in the first place. Well, that's the. We're actually here to get your help. There's a giant wither storm, and it's attacking the entire world. A wither what? What are you talking about? Who, who sent you? All right, Was it Calvin. Let's say Ivor created. No, Calvin? let's say Gabriel. Gabriel sent me. Look, you both seem like very pleasant people who are prone to fainting, but I simply don't have the brain power for this. She's I'm very focused. I wish I was the, I wish I was her. Block. Wish I was focused as her. Reality itself. Ooh, I'm so close. Uh, command like, blocks are trouble. Tastes like victory. I know that making a command block probably seems like a great idea, but you really don't want to do that. Wait, 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 wait. How do you know what a command? Don't block underestimate the guy with the suspenders. Uh, Ivor had one. Mega, ultra genius level stuff here. We've seen one up close before. It was Ivor's. He's done something terrible with it. The world needs the Order of the Stone. That's why we're here. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. You're the ones who brought this. Just like we sent her the amulet. Yeah, that no works for me. Um, let's, that belongs to me. No, I got it from Gabriel. Yes, the amulet. Gabriel gave it to me. That's how we found you. Yep. You did? So, could we have that back? Sure. I don't know why, but the I emulet looks really, really cool when it's glowing red. Yes. I don't really know why. So it reminds me of something indeed. from, like, a fantasy oh, game. Like a fantasy movie or block. something like that. I can use it to fight this Witherstorm monster thing, or whatever. Necessity is the original um, invention. That's a and great that idea. Yeah, she she invented, should build a command block. Of which perfect I way to originated. defeat another command Don't block. You understand? That sounds perfect. Your witherstorm problem was created by a command block. Yes, but that means a command block could be the perfect way of beating it. She's basically just said the and same thing that we just said. Help me make one. She's it's asking us to help time, her. I can um, it. let's do it. Right here, in my brain. Let's <laughs> Let's get started. Fantastic. All right, this scene right here, this is sort of like the training montage from episode one, but more cool for people who like redstone. Yeah, I actually really, really like this part. It's pretty cool. Uh, so we're gonna have a lot of button mashing to deal with here. E, uh, E, and Q again. Great commentary, Block Squad. Great commentary. All right, let's run over here and get the stuff from the chest. Now, while we're doing this training montage, I want to talk about the fact that um. I'm actually really, really enjoying doing this Let's Play. This is a game that I wanted to Let's Play for a while, and I'm pretty happy that I'm doing it. And, yeah, why'd you put steak on that? 
Whatever. Um, I'm just really, really glad that I'm finally let's playing this. It's turning out way better than I thought it would. I was expecting it to be pretty hard to let's play due to it being like a narrative-driven game with minimal amount of gameplay, but it's actually working very. What? Okay, whatever. <laughs> it's actually working very, very well. I don't know what that was, but okay. My computer did something very strange there. Uh, and... Okay, apparently Olivia's mad at us. I really don't know what that was, actually. My computer just randomly did that. Um... Okay, <laughs> sorry about that. Alright, mash Q. Works for me. But yeah, just like, um... This Let's Play is just really, really fun to do. This game is a game that I really, really like. I know, I know a lot about it. And it's just like, it's fun to like, tell you guys about it and share the game with you. And I just really, I hope that you guys are enjoying it, because I'm having a lot of fun filming this. Uh, so press E, right there. So, I'm really, really sorry about that thing that happened right there. It was really, I really don't know why that happened. That was really strange. Alright, mash Q again. And, there we go. And Jesse's determined face of epicness. You can sit here What the? Uh, okay. Flip that. <laughs> I, don't, I have no idea why that happened. But okay. Okay, okay excellent. Good. This is so exciting. Terrible, looks like the exciting. looks like the command block is finally forming. No, never. Is it destabilizing? And that's our cue to leave. Wither storm time! Oh man. Okay, now the Wither Storm's attacking us. Uh click here! Oh man. It's right outside the building. I would be terrified, honestly. I just freeze. I just I don't know if I'd ever be able to deal with something like that. Why do you have an outline around you, Elligard? Okay, here we go. Escape time. This is why I thought. This is why I think that um. This is why I think that uh, Redstone is a better story. Cause the Wither Storm shows up and demolishes everything. It's epic. Just look at that. The Wither Storm is so cool. I mean, technically it's not very cool because it's destroying the entire world, but technically just I find destruction kind of cool. Uh, especially when it's in Minecraft, it feels so cool just like running from this thing. Oh man. Thing is nasty. The portal. Hurry. And we are going to want to dodge it. Oh, oh god, it picked us up. Yeah, this is gonna happen no matter what. So you just gotta mash Q as hard as you can. Just you hit it with your sword. Use that sword like you mean it. And now we gotta run. Over here. All right, those cows. The cows. <laughs> I guess they're gonna die no matter what. Even if we kill them anyway, they're gonna die anyway. All right. And now, oh, run, and click. Nice. Oh, but we slipped. Oh, jeez. I forgot that I had to mash Q here. Ooh, there we go. Oh my god, it's getting so much bigger. You actually see there, it's gotten a lot bigger since episode one. Okay. I guess it's time to leave Redstonia. So guys, that is a really, really good place to end off for today. Oh man. So, we got Eligard, then her homeland was destroyed by the Witherstorm. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode, we'll head back to the Temple of the Order of the Stone and see how everybody's holding up. Lucas, everybody. See you guys later. Bye.